Welcome back to our channel, Nourishing Hearts. Today, we have a special treat for you. We're diving into the delicious world of vegan Italian recipes. Yes, you heard it right. You don't have to miss out on your favorite Italian flavors just because you're following a vegan lifestyle. So, let's get cooking and explore these mouth-watering dishes together. Introduction to Vegan Italian Cuisine Ciao, everyone! Italian cuisine is renowned for its rich flavors, fresh ingredients, and comforting dishes. And guess what? We're going to show you how to recreate those same amazing flavors, all in a vegan-friendly way. Get ready to tantalize your taste buds with plant-based renditions of classic Italian recipes. Vegan Spaghetti Bolognese First up, we have a vegan twist on a beloved classic, Spaghetti Bolognese. Instead of traditional ground meat, we'll be using lentils or mushrooms to create a hearty and flavorful sauce. Trust me, you won't even miss the meat. We'll also share some tips on how to achieve that authentic Italian taste by adding the perfect blend of herbs and spices. When it comes to vegan spaghetti bolognese, the key is to create a sauce that mimics the richness and depth of flavors found in the traditional meat-based version. Lentils and mushrooms are our secret weapons for achieving that hearty texture and umami taste. Preparing the Vegan Bolognese Sauce To start, we'll begin by finely chopping our mushrooms. Portobello mushrooms work particularly well due to their meaty texture and earthy flavor. Alternatively, you can use a combination of mushrooms like cremini or shiitake for added complexity. Heat up a large skillet with a drizzle of olive oil over medium heat. Add the chopped mushrooms and let them sauté until they release their moisture and turn golden brown. This step helps intensify their flavor. While the mushrooms cook, let's prepare our lentils. We recommend using green or brown lentils as they hold their shape well and provide a hearty bite. Cook the lentils according to the package instructions until they are tender but still firm. Now, let's turn our attention back to the mushrooms. To deepen their flavor and create that rich, meaty taste, we'll add a splash of soy sauce or tamari. This enhances the umami profile and adds a savory note to our sauce. Pour in a tablespoon of soy sauce or tamari and stir it into the mushrooms. Let them cook for a few more minutes until the liquid is absorbed, giving the mushrooms that desired umami boost. It's time to bring all the flavors together. We'll add our cooked lentils to the skillet with the mushrooms. This combination provides a wonderful texture and protein-packed substitute for the traditional ground meat. Mix the lentils and mushrooms together, ensuring they are evenly distributed. As the lentils heat through, they will absorb the flavors from the mushrooms, creating a deliciously savory base for our bolognese sauce. Enhancing the flavors Now that we have our lentil and mushroom base, let's take it to the next level by infusing it with aromatic herbs and spices. These will bring out the essence of traditional Italian flavors and give our vegan bolognese that authentic taste. Start by adding finely chopped garlic and onions to the skillet. Sauté them until they turn translucent and release their delightful aroma. This forms the foundation of our sauce. Next, we'll incorporate classic Italian herbs like oregano, basil, and thyme. These herbs contribute to the unmistakable Mediterranean character of our dish. Sprinkle a teaspoon of dried oregano, a handful of fresh basil leaves, torn into small pieces, and a pinch of dried thyme over the lentil and mushroom mixture. Gently stir the herbs in, allowing their fragrances to permeate the sauce. To balance the flavors, we'll add a touch of sweetness with a tablespoon of tomato paste. This will enhance the umami notes and add depth to our bolognese sauce. Incorporate the tomato paste into the mixture, ensuring it is well combined. Let it cook for a few minutes, allowing the flavors to meld together. Lastly, we'll add crushed tomatoes or passata to bring that signature tomato richness to our bolognese sauce. The acidity and sweetness of the tomatoes will complement the savory elements perfectly. And there you have it. Our vegan spaghetti bolognese sauce is now ready to be enjoyed. It's packed with protein, fiber, and a burst of Italian flavors. Now, let's talk about serving suggestions. Serving and enjoying the vegan spaghetti bolognese. For the complete experience, cook your favorite pasta according to the package instructions. Spaghetti or fettuccine work wonderfully, but feel free to use any pasta shape you prefer. Once the pasta is cooked al dente, 
drain it and return it to the pot. Now, it's time to combine the pasta with our delicious vegan bolognese sauce. Pour the sauce over the pasta and gently toss everything together, ensuring the sauce coats every strand of pasta. You can adjust the thickness of the sauce by adding a splash of pasta cooking water if desired. And voila! Our vegan spaghetti bolognese is now ready to be served. Look at that beautiful combination of hearty lentils, savory mushrooms, and aromatic herbs. Feel free to garnish your dish with some fresh basil leaves, a sprinkle of nutritional yeast for a cheesy flavor, or a drizzle of high-quality olive oil to enhance the richness. Mmm, it tastes just as satisfying as the traditional version. The lentils and mushrooms provide a delightful texture, while the herbs and spices create a harmonious symphony of flavors. So next time you're craving a comforting plate of spaghetti bolognese, give this vegan twist a try. It's a wholesome and delicious alternative that will make both your taste buds and your conscience happy. Creamy Vegan Alfredo Pasta Who doesn't love a creamy bowl of Alfredo pasta? Well, we have a vegan version that will blow your mind. We'll show you how to create a velvety sauce using cashews or cauliflower, giving you that luscious texture without any dairy. Prepare to indulge in a guilt-free plate of heavenly pasta. Get ready to experience a culinary revelation with our creamy vegan Alfredo pasta recipe. We're taking the classic, indulgent flavors of Alfredo sauce and transforming them into a plant-based delight. You won't believe how rich and velvety this sauce can be without any dairy products. Creating the Creamy Vegan Alfredo Sauce The secret to achieving that creamy texture lies in our two key ingredients, cashews or cauliflower. Both options offer a smooth and luxurious base for our sauce. Let's dive right in and see how it's done. If you're using cashews, start by soaking them in water for a few hours or overnight. This softens them and makes them easier to blend into a creamy consistency. Once they're soaked, drain the cashews and rinse them thoroughly. On the other hand, if you prefer a lower-fat alternative, cauliflower works wonders. Its mild flavor and natural creaminess make it an excellent choice for our vegan Alfredo sauce. If you're using cauliflower, chop it into florets and steam or boil them until they become tender. Once cooked, drain the cauliflower and set it aside. Now, let's move on to the sauce preparation. In addition to cashews or cauliflower, we'll need a few more ingredients to enhance the flavors and achieve that authentic Alfredo taste. In a high-speed blender or food processor, add the soaked cashews or cooked cauliflower along with some vegetable broth or plant-based milk. This helps create the creamy base of our sauce. To add a hint of cheesiness, we'll incorporate nutritional yeast, which provides a savory and slightly nutty flavor reminiscent of Parmesan cheese. Add a few tablespoons of nutritional yeast to the blender, along with a squeeze of fresh lemon juice for a touch of acidity and brightness. To bring it all together and add depth to our sauce, we'll season it with garlic powder, onion powder, salt, and pepper. These ingredients will elevate the flavors and give our Alfredo sauce that irresistible taste. Sprinkle in a teaspoon of garlic powder, a teaspoon of onion powder, and season with salt and pepper to taste. Blend all the ingredients together until you achieve a smooth and creamy consistency. Cooking and serving the creamy vegan Alfredo pasta. Now that our velvety Alfredo sauce is ready, let's cook the pasta and bring this dish to life. Cook your desired pasta according to the package instructions until it reaches al dente perfection. Remember to generously salt the boiling water to enhance the pasta's flavor. Once the pasta is cooked, drain it, reserving a small amount of the pasta cooking water. This water will come in handy for thinning out the sauce if needed and helping it adhere to the pasta. In a separate large skillet, heat a drizzle of olive oil over medium heat. Add the Alfredo sauce to the skillet and gently warm it, stirring occasionally. If the sauce thickens too much, you can gradually add some of the reserved pasta cooking water to achieve the desired consistency. Now it's time to combine the pasta and the luscious sauce together, ensuring each strand is coated in its creamy goodness. Add the cooked pasta to the skillet with the Alfredo sauce, tossing it gently until every piece is coated. If needed, you can add a splash more of the pasta cooking water to ensure an even distribution of the sauce. For a burst of freshness, we can incorporate some chopped fresh parsley or basil into the pasta. 
These herbs not only add a vibrant pop of color but also complement the creamy sauce beautifully. If you're feeling adventurous, you can also add some sautéed mushrooms or roasted cherry tomatoes to elevate the dish even further. These additions provide depth of flavor and add a delightful contrast to the creamy pasta. And there you have it. A guilt-free plate of heavenly, creamy vegan Alfredo pasta. Just look at that velvety texture and the enticing aroma. It's a true indulgence without any dairy. Now it's time to serve and savor this delectable dish. Garnish with a sprinkle of nutritional yeast or a drizzle of truffle oil for an extra touch of luxury. And of course, don't forget to grab a fork and dive into the creamy goodness. Mmm, it's truly a revelation. The cashews or cauliflower create a silky base, while the nutritional yeast and seasonings bring out that distinct Alfredo flavor we all love. You won't miss the dairy one bit. And there you have it, folks. A tantalizing journey through vegan Italian recipes. We hope you enjoyed this culinary adventure as much as we did. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give us a thumbs up if you want more delicious vegan recipes from around the world. Stay tuned for more scrumptious recipes, and as always, happy cooking. Buon appetito!